everybody gotta have some faith and love today i made an oopsie well is it really an oopsie not really because i'm making a video about it for today's video i am testing out the membership firsthand to make a fair judgment on whether or not the membership is worth it now my family thinks I got Robux, but what they don't know is I got the membership on Adopt Me that I will be canceling, so it's no biggie. You may not believe that I got the Adopt Me membership because of how poorly I talked about it, but because I feel so bad talking ill about this update when I haven't even tried it. Look, I'm going to show you right now. Look, see? You cannot see the offer for the membership. And I'm going to be showing you what is in my inventory and I can equip two pets. Are you ready? See, if I press lovely, look what it says, equip alt. So I'm going to be equip lovely because she's just as amazing as Miracle. And look, when I run, they walk right beside me. So there's no doubting that I have it now that you've seen it. Now the real question is, was it worth it? What made me want to get this in the first place was not only to give it a fair judgment, but I just really wanted to taste to see what it would be like with Lovely and Miracle side by side me. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you this entire video on what it's like to have membership so that you do not have to buy this yourself to know what it's like. And so far, what's got me interested is the two pets. I will say this, and I can say it again, I am not keeping this membership as it is, I think, a waste of money so far, as I kind of regret this purchase. But I mean, it fits to see ups and downs and be honest with you guys, and having tried it, maybe then this video could be very educational and it can help you guys be wise in making some type of purchase somewhere else where it isn't like stealing your money or it isn't a ripoff. So with VIP, it comes with a sticker pack, it comes with a limo, and it comes with a chow bone, etc. I did get the chow bone. See, I have an extra chow chow. So I was not lucky there. So the fact that the odds are against me getting a legendary, I feel like that part is not worth it for the membership. The fact that I got a regular pet that fans give me anyway, it's like, yeah, it's not worth it. Especially when like Chows don't even have much value, but I'm going to be going to school and I have something I would really love to show you that Adomi did that I can applaud them for. And later in the video, I will be showing you what the rocket is like. My sister bought this for me. This rocket basically gives you the accessibility to go home just like the magical door. But everybody's thinking it's a waste of Robux. So I want to see if it actually is a waste of Robux or if it's really good. I'll show it in the end of the video. I'm vibing with Miracle and Lovely next to me. So right now, they both have the school task. Now what I like about this membership is that you can equip two pets even though i feel like if it's going to be a membership you can equip three pets i just feel like that's best but i will say that they increased the bucks that you're allowed to get like the bucks cap even though one pet gets more tasks than the other the alt one does not get as much tasks but at least it's something at least it's something i think they did it to avoid much lagginess or something i think that's why they did what they did but if you don't want that cap to be there if you do not want any limits to the tasks that your pets could be getting all you can do is get an alt account trade one of your pets to the alt equip your alt's pet then take care of both of those pets and then boom you get no bucks in limit and you actually get the same amount of tasks on your alt pet as you would your main. So far with what I've experienced, is it worth having this membership, having the chow bone, having the sticker pack, having these two pets equipped? Is this worth it? For now, I only have the pets around me right now. I have an extra chow, and I guess one more I can make neon, but I was, really was hoping for the golden chow as the golden chow is not really found much. I wonder if the golden chow is worth much, but, as for the sticker pack, I didn't get any legendaries, and also, 
there's a limit of tasks for your alt pets to have. So I would say no, this is not worth it for now. I will be exploring the extra VIP house that was given to me from this membership. So I will try to decorate it a bit. So that's at least something for you guys to look forward to. But I cannot judge it fairly just with these few minutes of having this membership. I need to have like at least a day or an hour or two to get a taste of the membership and see if it's actually worth it. So I'm willing to do this for you guys. One thing that's cool also about this membership is that you get both pets equipped and you don't have to get involved with an alt if in case you don't have another device or in case that you know your internet is pretty poor on one device and you get disconnected every 10 seconds like it would on my alt so this is a win-win for me at least because my alt gets disconnected very 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 quickly every single time i rejoin there's no point in it because it always disconnects so this really does help for when I can't be on my alt and you get age potions if you take care of two already full-grown pets you can get age potions at the same time which I feel is actually really really useful so the fact that I can get age potions and possibly be able to make neons do to me having two of these pets equipped it's really good and if you're also wondering which pets to equip because you have like two as your favorite and you wish that you could have two, this definitely helps with that as well because you don't have to worry about hurting a pet's feelings. And what I love also is if you noticed what I just did right there, it shows the names of the pets instead of what pet they are so that it makes it a lot easier for neon makers to be able to place their pet based on their name and their needs, which I found really cool of Adopt Me to actually have that up Update, whether you're a member or not they made that update to where people can actually not be confused on where to put a pet to be completely see-through with you guys look at this VIP house it shows at the very top which means I just got it and it's white which I want to make pink this time since my other one is purple but I want to decorate my purple one since it already has some wallpaper but I really want to check this out I forgot what VIP looks like when you just get it so let's go have a tour have a tour with me guys see if you look already there's pretty yank yucky wallpaper in my opinion but I love the cyan castle I love everything in there it gives me like the nostalgia of getting my first VIP house okay it's not that important but I'm going to equip my very first VIP house and I'm going to show you that I already have this wallpaper and I'm going to decorate it a bit so that you guys see what I can do for my preppy houses. Already if you look at this, I've already spent the money on the wallpaper and the ground so I won't have to spend extra extra money to try to put these back in this VIP house. What I did was I sold it so I could create my other preppy house which I again sold. So I'm going to be putting stuff here and you'll get to see a montage of me trying to build. I think I like pink and blue best but I will still love a bunch of pink. A bunch of pink.
All right, guys, so for now, I am finished. Look how amazing this looks already. I'm going to be building it even off camera, and when I'm done, I will show you guys. But I wish that the VIP house and, well, actually, the limos are tradable, but I wish the VIP houses were also tradable since, like, we've been given two of them. I think if you're a VIP already, you got one, and now if you have the membership, you got one. So why can't this be also tradable? That would be nice, because I would love to do a little giveaway on a preppy VIP. VIP house that would be epic I'm actually gaining bucks pretty quickly as they're both in camp task and look at the amount of bucks that I get right now that is so cool there's nothing too special about having this membership so far I, I feel like I low-key do regret it because I had like 50 bucks to my name and now I have less due to this membership but I mean hey at least it helps a little bit Speaking of age pots, I just got one and I'm going to feed it to the birthday butterfly 2024. It's just since my sister's not playing, I get to use it on my own pets. I go on Adopt Me daily, so this should be no biggie, as I'm actually almost halfway to getting a neon birthday butterfly 2024 and I want to paint it pink. So, I mean, with this company, it's really, really good, but again, like I said earlier, it would be really nice if for the membership it would be three pets you know like three pets for the membership and for the normal average players or vip it would be two pets like they should have it to where vip and membership have completely different perks and it would be really nice for vip and membership to have completely different name tags completely different houses completely different rewards just have the vip and the membership have a completely different feel to it or shifting all the membership stuff to only VIP and then for the people who already spent their money on the membership they get an exclusive pet as an apology but to have everything on VIP what do you guys think and if you feel poor and if you want two pets equipped and not want to have to take care of too much tasks all you have to go is go to backpack then search up bat dragon then you'll have a pet next to you that doesn't need any tasks and you look completely rich you can fool everybody as i kind of fooled tiger Rainbow X Halo shared to me an idea that I think would be wonderful on Adopt Me. She shared that she thinks that Adopt Me should have it to where membership people or VIP people get to choose the color for their name tag. Like, you know how you can select furniture and multicolor it and you can just choose whatever color? She thinks that it's really good if you can add just your own color to the name and then have the badge next to it and have everyone have a different color besides red and baby blue. Which I agree completely. Now that I've had the membership for quite a while, is it worth buying it for around $5 now? Or $4 a month? Or even more from wherever you are? Is it worth it? Um, not really. I mean, I really wanted this due to having two pets equipped, but to pay per month for this, maybe paying a one-time thing can make, be, maybe make it worth it, but per month it just feels excessive, and, like, I didn't really experience much other than the two pets, the chow bone, like, the things that it listed, but... Like, there's nothing really sustaining my need for this membership. Like, I'm glad I can cancel at any time, but I just feel that this is not it. This is not it. So in all summary, this membership is not worth it. Now you can actually trust my word because I paid for it. So the only real good thing about this membership is you can equip two pets. That's what everyone was excited for. So if you really want that, then you should just go on an alt account and then trade your pets to that alt and equip it on your alt. Uh, turn the follows off, pet follows, and then you'll be able to have two pets following you just like you would for the membership. I have an entire video on how to get membership completely for free without having to spend $3 a month or $4 a month for this membership. Yeah, this is just not worth it and in the future I will go on an alt or something to keep this feeling of having the membership. But honestly, this was not worth it and I low-key kind of regret the purchase. But for the sake that I did spend around $5 for this membership, I will keep it until it almost renews, then I'll cancel it right before it renews. 
and there you guys that's my honest review there are some good things to this membership okay but there are some mostly negatives to this like you do not get like really legendary pets from this you don't get much good things from this update all of that's good and that you feel like the only thing you have now is literally the pets following you and is that really worth the money no it's not i see i already have some of these stickers from opening the pack already but like is it really worth it no not only to trying to get the animated sticker and get the frost dragon or something out of it then maybe it'd be worth it and then you'd be like wow i got a fresh dragon for like five dollars but honestly nah i don't intend on keeping this i'm going to show you the rocket's use now but yeah i just th this membership just me having it and testing it out for myself without being biased for me not being able to get it or something i actually bought it and now i'm able to clearly say with no bias like i'm actually able to say with experience that this is not worth it okay guys so i'm going to be showing you what this purpose of this rocket is i'm going to equip it right now and my pets are following me as usual they actually greeted me so that actually was a warm welcome but i'm going to show you the rocket that my sister gave me it's over here i put it in my pet needs whatever it is uh, the task and look at this it's it's so cool it's so large and when I place it down, I want to see what it looks like if I'm not on it. Okay, I'm going to say launch to your house. Okay, let's watch from afar and see where it goes, okay? And, oh my gosh, that balloon completely ruined it. I'm going to have to place it somewhere else. But this seems already pretty cool. I mean, it has an animation. Let me see what it looks like when I'm not on it. And I try to put it in a, in a way where it's a clear sky. Okay, let me back up. And it actually, oh, oh, okay, okay. I mean, I mean, at least I saw something. Now, should I go on this one? I'm going to actually place it down over here. And then I'm going to make sure that I actually get on this time. I'm going to make sure I get on. I'm going to take a seat on my rocket and grab both Miracle and Lovely with me. So I don't leave them behind. And I'm going to teleport to my house. And you'll see the animation if you have this rocket, okay? Let's see. We twist and oh my gosh. We just went to the sky and we just teleported to our home now that we tested out the rockets i can say with confidence that is it worth it i mean to me i think it's actually really cool the animation actually does do quite a lot to satisfy the eye of the person who bought it however we do have the magic door already and we have the reset button so you do not have to spend robux to get this rocket ship as this rocket ship the only cool thing about it is the animation it doesn't really do much and i love the sound effect actually I hope you really liked this video and I hope it was informational. If you liked it, please like and subscribe. Get me to 100k. And I hope that you don't get scammed. I hope that you don't scam. Be the friend that everyone needs because there's not much of that right now. And have faith.